I think that Wreck-It Ralph is how Luke Sword and Demix got into our hero's version of, of the world. So in Union Cross, if you haven't played it, you know, there's the five foretellers, there was a Keyblade War, all the Keyblade wielders who fought in that war died except for the Dandelions who uh, fled the Keyblade War. And yeah. they were appointed five new Union leaders by Master Ava. Oh yeah, that's set up in the back cover. Yeah, so some of that is in back cover, but a lot of it they haven't put into cutscene form yet. But it's in Union Cross. And so those new Union leaders were Ventus, uh, Marluxia's original person, Lorium, Ephemer, Scald, and Brain. There's some crazy stuff going on, but they're setting it up to where somehow Lorium and Ventus at least end up in the future at some point. But while this crazy stuff is going on, they realize that they are actually in a data version of the uh, of Daybreak, of Daybreak Town, that they haven't been in the real version of Daybreak Town. And so the, the reason they realize this is because things start glitching up around them. They start seeing people that, that aren't there. They kind of like appear and disappear, kind of the digital effects transitioning. Yeah. Uh, and while this is happening, these data heartless, similar, a little bit similar to the bugs from Recoded, start appearing. And they follow these heartless, and they end up following them into Game Central Station from Wreck-It Ralph. Oh, really? So they end up going to Wreck-It Ralph's world. And I guess the reason why Wreck-It Ralph was able to be connected to the world is because they're in a digital world. So somehow Wreck-It Ralph's world got cross, cross-wired with theirs. Nice. So my theory is, because we see Gilzara, uh, Verum Rex is a video game within the toy box world. Mm-hmm. What if Verum Rex is one of those games in Game Central Station that we just haven't seen yet? Oh, I like this. And Luke Sword and Demix end up crossing over from Game Central Station into the Union Cross. What if King of Hearts 4 involves going to Game Central Station and playing in Sugar Rush? That would be my actual <laughs> dream. <laughs> That'd be nice. You have no idea. You have no idea how much I want Sora to hang out with Vanellope. That's crazy. I really want that to be true. That would be awesome. Yeah, and I'm surprised. I don't think anybody has tr- so far of all the YouTube theorists. I haven't seen anybody yet make any connection between... Wreck-It Ralph and Yozero, which to me I feel like is kind of obvious because they're both video game characters within this this world. It did, it did occur to me when you said that he was a video game character. Like, I didn't realize that until, like, we started recording this because I'm dense and forgot, like, all this stuff in Toy Box. But, like, I was like, well, surely because you can summon Ralph, then maybe they're connected in that way. I don't know. But um, that would make a lot of sense. Yeah. Well, supposedly the reason you can summon Ralph is because Ventus was in Sword's heart and Ventus had gone to Wreck-It Ralph's world in the past. Yeah. That's why he was able to summon. Interesting. Interesting.